What's up? Hi, Firestarter here, and this is my review of the SH Regard Shinken Yellow Hanaori Kotoha. This is just an exclusive brown box. It came with Shinken Yellow. And let's get Shinken Yellow out. Throw the brown box. Show you the front side. And this is Shinken Yellow. Hanari Kotoha. Oh, Kotoha Hanari. And we have here the same thing as other um, Shinken or SHF figures. We have, it says here SH Regards. Very yellowish box. Shinken Yellow, Shinken Yellow. Summer Center, Shinken Ja! Shinken Yellow's uh, photo. And this is not the actual um, suit actor, but the SHF figure. Um, blurb, Shinken Yellow. Her name here, Hanaori Kotoha. Samurai of um, Earth. Yellow. Map. Simple poses and simple photos of the origami, um, the monkey origami, and the land slicer. So, without further ado, let's look at the contents. Cluttered. Uh, this is how I do things. So, um, going through the parts, she has extra skirt parts so you can move the legs further. So you can extend the legs further. And there are rubbery yellow in yellow mold with black lines here. I'll just place that aside. Shinken Maru still the same look and feel. We have the Shiba clan symbol at the end of the handle. Nothing spectacular here. Sodophone. Ibi Sojo. Extra hands. Um, they some of the hands are very specific to certain poses. Like these hands are for when she introduces herself to the Gidoshu. Hanari Kotoha, and then he uses she uses uh, this pose with the sword, which I will be demonstrating later. But then aside, we got chopping hand. We have actually a pair. We have this one. This one is very specific in holding the blade of this accessory, which is the land slicer. It fits well because there's actually a groove here that would allow you to hold the um, land slicer by the blade, just like so. I'll take this one out, and this is the blade. It can turn. It has the land symbol here, and I didn't notice this until I got the SHF figure. There's also a symbol of the Shiba clan here at one of the blades. There's also a, uh, another one here at the back, and there's a handle here so she can use it as a shield when this land slicer turns around, just like so. Okay. Next, uh, we have the origami, we have the monkey, and the suri saru origami. Um, the saru origami has really nice mold, but um, I know they could do it better by um, darkening some of the lines to make it highlight even more. We have the monkey origami in transformed mode. And the hands can move because they have hinges. You can turn it around 360. That's the only thing that moves on this origami. That's all. There's also hands. Forgot to mention there are, are also hands to hold the origami. Just specifically to hold the origami. We have this for the soda phone. We have this ordinary holding hand just to hold the shikamaru that's it you might have not noticed but there's also the hidden disc rested underneath the triangle symbol over here or the land symbol here just showing you that it exists 
on the land slicer. That's all about the accessories. Let's move on with Hanari Kotoha. So say hello to Kotoha. Um, of course, he she has a head articulation, neck joint, shoulders, symbols here, double joints, symbol in the hand, um, upper torso with um, better reach than other Shinkengers. We have the um, phone holder, the hidden disc holder, the um, sling, joint, double jointed knee, and same as other S uh, SHF Shinkengers, ball jointed foot, and hinge on a toe. Now we have the land, um, land symbol or earth on her um, visor. Um, we she also have vents. I mean at least lines, as you can see on the uh, helmet design. Um, she has a bust line. We have here the um, samurai uh, gi, so to speak. Some uh, Shiba clan symbol and that's it she's really um, simple and plain just like her actual character simple meek and uh, full of spirit now let's play with the accessories like okay let's do the Hanaori Kotoha um, pose just to make a point that there are really good specific hands that um, SHF has considered. I can do better on my photos when, when I do posing on, for my photos but this is what it looks like. Hanari when she introduces herself to um, or when they do the roll call if you can remember. Um, I don't really have major complaints about Hanari Kotoha or Shinken Yellow. Um, in terms of uh, ratio head to body ratio he she does have a big head um, which is slightly proportionate unproportionate to her whole body but anyway on, on the show anyway um, when I saw the um, show I mean the head really is not proportionate to her body um, I didn't mind really that much but um, good I could wish because I, I could wish I could get some more out of Shinken Yellow because she's an exclusive figure. So as the other women other women in the SHF Shinken Jer line, Shinken Pink is also an exclusive. Even the upcoming Go Kaiger figures, the women are exclusive. I don't know why. Um, I didn't dwell more on the actual changing of the skirt. Because if you've seen my review of um, Kaoru, Shinken Red Kaoru, uh, you definitely know how to change the, the skirt. And then I'll just emphasize on when I do the photo, photo ops on this toy. The reason why you're getting this is because you want to complete the whole five. That's the reason. Why, that's the reason why you're getting Shinken Yellow, not because. You want her because you want to complete the whole five. It's not Super Sentai if you're lacking characters, right? So if you are, you have started collecting um, SHF um, Super Sentai figures, it's inevitable that you have to get the rest of the team. So if you want to know the possibilities for this figure, um, do check out the photos. Let me know if you got your own SHF um chink and yellow give your own comments on the description box or the comment section down below um let me know what you think about chink and yellow and the rest of the women in shinkenjers what i mean is for the shf line so if you want to know the possibilities check out the photos at the end of the video do subscribe to my blogspot facebook twitter for updates if you want to chat with me yeah i have my Facebook page it's growing the community is growing so thank you so much to the fans who just subscribed to my blog and to my Facebook account 
it's getting busy there so do check it out now this is far starter thank you so much for the opportunity to review you to um, let you see my review of SHF Shinkanello and see you to my next review.